Hello you guys and welcome back to my channel. Today's tutorial is going to be on this look right here. It is kind of like a nice feeling myself going out type of look. So if you guys feel like going out or even just staying home and watching some Netflix and you just want to look bomb as fuck or on fleek, let's continue on into this tutorial. I've already concealed my eye with the Tarte Shape Tape. I use this instead of primer because I think it works better and it looks nicer. So I've already done that and I've set it with some setting powder. So we're gonna go ahead and move on to the eyeshadow. So I'm gonna be using my Modern Renaissance Palette from Anastasia for this look. I've been obsessed with this palette. So I'm gonna use it again for another video. So what I'm going to do is I'm, I'm just going to set down my transition real quick and I'm going to use the shade Warm Taupe to set my transition. So I'm just going to take my Anastasia Double Ended Brush that it came up with. I'm just going to do that real quick. And then I'm just going to go into, I'm going to mix Tempera and, Tempera and Vermeer. So I'm going to mix these two for my brow bone highlight. And I'm just going to take the flat side end of the Anastasia brush just and take those two colors and just set them right under my brow bone. I'm just going to take a little bit more of the mirror so I can give it that kind of highlight, like a nice subtle highlight since this is like um, a shimmer shade. So the next colors I'm going to be going into is a set of three. I'm going to be taking Venetian Red, Love Letter, and Cypress Umber. And I'm just going to take those three. I'm going to take more of the red shades and just very little of that brown shade so I, that I get this nice color. And it's going to show up more pinkish purple than the brown that I mix in with it, but it's just going to give, the brown's just going to give it a little bit more depth to the color. So I'm just going to focus this on my outer third. I'm just gonna bring it into the crease. And I'm using my MAC 217 blending brush that I've been obsessed with lately. And then I'm just gonna focus more on the red shades. I'm not gonna pick up any more of that brown. And I'm gonna drag that all the way in. All right, and then I'm just gonna go back to the shade Vermeer. And this is gonna go in the inner corner of my eye. So I'm just gonna set that down. And then I'm going to use the shade Buon Fresco. I totally think I butchered that. Buon, 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 it's B-U-O-N. Not sure I really how to pronounce that, but it's that purple shade. And I'm going to use that in the middle to connect the two shades together. And then I'm just going to go back to those red, purple shade, reddish purple shades and just lightly bring that in just because some of that lavender had covered it. Now I'm just going to take some some setting spray and I'm going to go back into that shade of Vermeer just to kind of intensify the color a little bit. I'm not flipping a little shimmery. So I'm just going to spray that right on to the eyeshadow and I'll lay that down. So now we're just going to mimic everything on the lower lash line and instead I'm going to be taking the Pizzanti Eye Contour eyeshadow contour brush. And then I'm just gonna dip into Warm Taupe as the first shade, and I'm just gonna bring that all the way across. And then I'm gonna dip into the Boyan Fresco, and I'm gonna focus this on the inner center area. And then I'm gonna dip into the Venetian Red and Love Letter, and focus this on the outer corner. I'm just gonna dip back into that Boyan Fresco, and focus this on the center. And then go back in with the warm taupe and just kind of blend underneath. And then I'm going to go ahead and take my flat liner brush from MAC. And this is the 212. And I'm just going to dip into Cypress Umber, which is that dark brown shadow. And I'm going to use this to line the outer corner of my bottom lash. And I'm just going to drag this to the center only. And then I'm going to take my Makeup Forever Aqua XL liner in the shade Black. I'm just going to tight line my eyes real quick. Alright, so I'm just going to go ahead and complete the liner and lashes off camera. I'm just going to line my eye. I'm not going to do a wing today. So I'll be right back, you guys. 
Alright, so I went ahead and finished my eye off camera and I went ahead and popped on the Icon Lashes and I used the style Beverly Hills. I do have a discount code for you guys to use if you guys want to buy your own lashes from Icon. If you use the discount code HiLena, you will get 35% off your entire purchase. I'm going to leave the info down below for you guys to check, at, check it out. The last thing I'm going to do is do my lips real quick. And I'm going to be using the Coco Collection from Kylie Cosmetics. And I'm going to be using the shade Flow Money, which is a nice, which is just a nice mauve like neutral shade. And then I'm going to lay Damn Gina, which is the, the gloss on top of it. So I'm going to go ahead and do that real quick. You know, to be honest, I feel like I should just leave it as is. I'm not going to apply the gloss on it because I just like it the way that it is. So this is going to be the completed look for this. Mm, mm, mm. I really love this shade Clo Money from the Kylie Cosmetics collection. So I'm just going to go ahead and leave it like this. I'm not even going to apply the gloss on because what's the point? I think it looks pretty dang good like this. I'm really, like really obsessed with this like look right now, so that's a good thing. But this is a, the completed look for you guys. Feel free to recreate this and go out tonight and have some fun. Or you can even just stay home and watch Netflix, but it still look bum. It's good. I really don't understand what's going on with my eye right now. So yeah, feel free to go out tonight and have some fun and look hot AF. Or you can stay home and still look hot AF. It's up to you guys. But if you guys do like this video, please be sure to give it a thumbs up. And don't forget to hit that subscribe button because I do post new videos every Sunday and Wednesday for you guys. You guys have an amazing day. Peace out.